Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be doing an upgrade on my 2IS that I should have done like 15 years ago when I got this car. I'm putting on the illuminated door seals. These door seals were originally an option and only came on certain models and most cars didn't have them and I could have gotten them for like $200 back in the day but I was just too cheap. So today we're going to be upgrading them. So stay tuned. So the illuminated scuff pads were originally part of like the luxury package and the sport package. In 2006 to 2008, I think they came in the blue versions. Uh, starting in 2008 and up, they offered a white version of this. So I randomly picked these up on eBay. I paid almost $200 for these, but I got the rear ones. The rear ones don't have any kind of markings or lighting. They just have that metal right there, which is a little bit different than the original ones. The original ones are just straight plastic. And these are already like 80 or $90, just brand new from the factory. The front ones, the ones that actually light up, they're about 120 to 100 thirty dollars from the dealer right now brand new so I got this whole set for less than two hundred dollars so what you have here is you have this connector and most versions of the car already have this connector I believe the 06 is only the luxury and the sport package came with it the other ones didn't from 07 to 09 I believe all versions got the wiring harness and then starting in 2010 all the way up to the end of the 2IS they quit putting the plug and the factory wiring in the car so you actually have to rig it to the existing wiring in the car right now and I'll show you once I'm in the car where you can tap that wire if your car doesn't have this. So if we look at the back of these, they have a bunch of different part numbers. Some of them are actually scratched out in the molding for various versions of this. So the actual plastic hasn't really changed between all the models, but the LED has changed. So some of the LED part numbers have been scratched out. And I took a gamble on this. Uh, the junkyard that I bought it from didn't know what color it was. And it came off a newer IS. I think it was a 10 or 11 luxury package. And I just assumed they came with white at the time. So luckily these were white because I plugged them up earlier just to check. So the white ones look a little bit better than the blue ones. Blue ones are kind of a turquoise and a greenish blue, not really a white. And I figured the white would go better with my car. So to remove this is pretty simple. You could probably pop this off without any tools. Just pop it out by hand. Once you get in there, just pull the plug right here, plug it into a new one and snap it back on and that should be it. Once you get in here, just look around this area back here and you'll see the plug. It's actually right here in front of my face, the white plug right there. So in the past, I've tapped other stuff to use this light. So you can see the wires coming out of here and then this green wire going up that way. If you don't have this plug in here, you're gonna have to pull your own power. And the best place to find it is right here, the LED that goes underneath here for the door light right under here. So you could tap it under there. So to install it, all you have to do is just plug this thing in, snap it back on and that's it. Pretty easy, less than a minute install for these.
guys, thanks for joining me on this quick upgrade video on this IS250. It's been a long awaited upgrade for me on those scuff pads. I should have did this a long time ago, but I was just way too cheap back when I first got the car. And I thought it was kind of a frivolous upgrade, but now that I've upgraded all I could on this car, I decided to get these things. Plus they're a little bit more affordable now. Anyways, if you guys need any of the part numbers or anything, I'll have them listed down in the description box. So check that out down there. In addition, if I see any eBay listings, I'll just post them down there in case you guys want to set too. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, just to stay on top of all my different DIYs on this car, on the IS300, on the Sienna, or anything in the garage, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Turn on bell notifications to get notified every time I upload a video. Remember guys, for all these simple projects, if I can do it, you guys can do it. I want to thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.